If your audio is bad, here are three things that'll help. Now these tips will be related to getting you a better sounding vocal recording. Number one is to crossfade your audio clips. When one audio clip is cut directly into the next clip, you may get a pop in your recording. This is because you didn't properly transition from one clip to the next one. You need to make sure to crossfade your audio clips so that they transition smoothly with no damage or pops. Number two is to use equalization. An EQ is an audio tool that essentially isolates frequencies and gives you the option to boost or lower those frequencies. And by using an EQ on your vocal, you're creating a much more leveled and smooth audio recording. And just for example, here's my voice before using equalization, and here's my voice after using equalization. And number three is to use compression. Compressors are used to reduce an audio signal's dynamic range. And dynamic range is the distance between the loudest and the quietest moments in that audio recording. So essentially, the main goal of compression is to establish a consistent and smooth audio level from your audio signal. And for another example, here's my voice before using compression, and here's my voice after using compression.